This is a three-day, two-night backpacking trip from the Escalante City down to the bridge of the Escalante River. In the middle, we hiked up to Death Hollow, and we explored some of the narrows up there. Hope you enjoy, and thanks for watching. We made it to Eva Coffee House. Eva. It's like a cool little hike down to it. We'll show you what's inside. So the lady he brought us our drinks. That's mine. We decided to move because it was too hot. Barry and his burrito. That's getting also falling apart. Cool little table that's a sand. I've never seen that before. Well, we're at the trailhead and he's getting suited up. This is the last that we'll see of the town. Any last words? Yeah, I'm never going backpacking again. The sun's blaring at us. And we get to see the river every now and then, which is right here. Give us an update, Eddie. Oh, we're not at two miles yet, but spectacular views that unfortunately the phone will never capture clearly. <laughs> we just hit mile three mm -hmm. and now there's this cool little alcove over there we're gonna go check it out and hear people up the river come across these this massive cove Eddie, you want to open the box and tell us what's inside? Just open it. It's a ranger fish. I don't want to open it with my hands. It's from the ring. It's from the experiment. It's probably explaining this. Oh, really? Okay. I'm going to believe you. Yeah, pull up. There you go. Mm -hmm. What's that in there? What's it say? This panel is attributed to the Fremont culture, inhabited these areas for about 1,350 years. That was a really good piece of meat. Mm. Eddie was nibbling on that. A lot of good nutrition for backpacking, I'll tell you that. Little Eddie, happy as can be. We're about to head up to Death Hollow. There's a lot of wind noise probably. And we're on our way to Dangerous River. Just kidding. We're ready to enjoy and find a camping spot. Stay at us. So we went upstream, couldn't find anything. Downstream, there's a spot kind of a little bit past right there. Mm -hmm. We're going to make a vote whether to stay there or go back up the river just a little bit into a couple places there. I think I'm ready to cast my vote. And your vote is? I think we go back a little bit. Give us an update, Eddie. Wow, well, we're done with camp. We rested up, hung up all our food. Now we're on our way to the waterfall here. It's a very small creek waterfall. Well, we're here. The waterfall's behind that tree, and we're gonna go through this little marshy land to get there. Eddie, see if it's quicksand. Yeah, I'm gonna see. <laughs> oh, you're so mean. Come over here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it is quicksand. <laughs> oh, are you still recording this? Yeah. Okay. Well, this is it. Shaikon is getting closer to a group of fishes that are inside of this pond. Well. <laughs> What? We're both tired. We've hiked probably, I would say, close to 10 miles. Got my tent over there. Eddie's is over there. And what are you cooking? Potatoes and bacon bits next. And we got tortillas to go along with it. What are you having for dinner tonight? M&M's. I believe this is lasagna. Mm. But uh, I could be wrong. <laughs> got my water boiling right here. Got your potatoes coming. It's turning out exactly, exactly how I want it to. Let's we'll see. Oh. It's not necessarily a soup, but it is potatoes. Here I have bacon bits. 
What do you call that monstrosity? No idea. Tortillas with mashed potatoes and bacon bits. <laughs> it's above boiling temperature. Mine's still cooking. The chef says it's gonna be done any minute. Your mountain house meal's ready. How's it taste? <clears throat> it tastes like mountain house. The journey gets even better. It's day two. Great morning. And most importantly, what we're gonna eat. Woken up to a beautiful morning. I slept like a baby last night. Slept through the whole night. Uh, way late. What, 9.30? Hardly ever do, but man, I was tired. We're just about to have lunch. Yep. Or not lunch, uh, breakfast. How'd you sleep, Eddie? There's a fly somewhere. Uh, I slept pretty warm. What are you eating? Chicken Alfredo pasta. And then breakfast? Yeah, that's for breakfast. Where are we about to head? About to head into Death Hollow. Feet away from us. Over there. We got all our gear for the day. And the water is freezing. Yes, it from... is. All right, let's do it. Death Hollow. Our feet are still ice cold, like stings. Uh-huh. This water is freaking cold. Like... That's cold, by the way. Backdrop is a giant cove. Huge towering cliffs. We're headed to this cove up here. Our first little waterfall. This is where we'll come probably take photos later in the day. So what did we find? This perfect little beach spot to go camping at. White sand, it's hot and it's nice. Look at this, look at this, look at this. And we got a waterfall over here, dripping into a nasty pool, but still awesome that you're surrounded by water. You got the waterfall over here. Super beautiful. There's a little ducky. There it goes. Yep. Eddie slipped in the water. Casualty. Yeah, it actually stayed pretty dry in there. We should see if it turns on. Looks dry to me. Nice. Saved it. Eddie's found a little beach right across from a waterfall. It goes way up there. Stop for a snack break. Meat and crackers, cheese, and a little sausage. Another waterfall, tiny one, but full nonetheless. Look at this canyon, sheer cliffs. Can you see that little dot? That dot is ready. About to enter the most narrow spot that we've yet come across. Eddie trugging along through the narrows. <laughs> This okay. is where the canyon's getting pretty cool. A lot of little narrows to go through. All right, let's go. Nice moss to limit your traction. Yeah. Check that out right in front of us. So that's the first. There's a second. And look at the last one all the way in the back. This one's going to be deep. Here we go. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, I'm such a terrible friend. Woo! You made it! <laughs> the only method to do out here. Ah! Is it cold? It's cold. <laughs> Icon likes to get away from the video and the mess ups that may happen, but it's pretty freaky. Look how fast that water is. Woo! Pretty scary. Slip and slide. <laughs> King of the hill. It was forthcoming. <laughs> it was foreshadowed. And he said it was slippery and then went down. I missed it. Now I have to do another damage analysis. I think my backpack is. He's going to check his pack. I'm going to head up this way. There's a waterfall way up there. It looks like a little tiny uh, hidden oasis back here. Wow, this is cool. Look at that cold. Look at the little a little swimming pool. The water's so warm. Look at that. Hot tub cove. So I did a damage analysis of my backpack. No water damage anywhere, which is good. Wow, I like it. Look at that little cove behind you. Pretty. Back the way we came. Look at that. Huge tree. I think I found a deep spot. There's the sand right here. Look at that. Oh, up. Go, go. Just got stuck again. Oh. How was that? Like sand is no joke. We got a water snake. 
finally found a fish. As I'm in the and he's not even moving. Oh, there he goes. Looks like the canyon's kind of opened back up and uh, we're gonna head back. He doesn't want to get wet. Congrats, sir. Here's your million dollars. All right, Eddie. What'd you think of Death Hollow? We're about to exit, which is right down that way. What if What if you had to go back up that canyon to where we stopped? I'll just go ahead and buy whatever I need to. How's it feel to be back in camp? Feels great. Almost gone. You gonna have dinner? Yeah. It's gonna be a new meal, too. What is Chef Boyardee making today? Beef, pasta, marinara. Well, let's give it a try. Let's see. Good, but I wish I had salt. Favorite part about this trip and least favorite part about this trip? Least favorite part is the walking part. The best part of the entire trip is the river that was in this. Amazing river and the way the water flowed. Got my coffee. Day number three, last day we hike out today. What's on breakfast menu today? Ramen. I'm having granola cereal. Whoa, that's hot. Eddie gets nervous when the followers start to watch him eat. Ouch. 10 out of 10. Nice calm day to end the trip on. As soon as we're done, we're gonna pack up camp and then once we get all packed up, head out. So we got camp all packed up. Yeah, this has been a great venture. Now we're gonna head out to the van today, about seven miles. We are packed up and we are ready to head out. Yeah, I wish seven I could miles. Just, I wish I could snap my fingers and be at the car. Such a stupid trail. <laughs> Get that camera out of my face, man. I'm gonna throw that thing in the water. Found this little cave over here. Got these cool formations up there. Would you camp here? Uh, that's pretty cool. The Escalante. And this is the uh, Sand River. And that's really dumping a lot of water into this river. We're at uh, Cliff Arch, right up there. What have we found? We found a little hut. Look at that, it's even got like a sidewall to the right. And it's got this little Cliff Arch up here. Would you live there? I would. Another angle. Look at all this cliff art. You got a little beetle there. How does it feel to almost be done? I don't think we're almost done. We made it. We made it back to the to the van. Happy to see the van? Yeah. Well, we made it out. How glad you are you to be sitting in this van? My feet still hurt though. I think my toenail's ready to pop off. Probably when I get home, I'll just... All right, well, we're gonna go get pizza and I think we'll be in a better mood in 45 <laughs> minutes. So well, we got pizza. It's time to end the trip. All right, 